individuals to protect Earth and our allies. Courageous pioneers committed to the highest ideals of justice. No, that's no oh. Nico, a galaxy ranger with a special talent. The human race faces grave dangers from beyond the stars. Wait, Doc. Amplified by her brain implant, her powers give her brilliant images of the past and the future. Capturing humans. We've got to find out why. This is Ranger 1. All launch codes are green. Launch sequence activated. Warp coordinates loaded, Ranger 1. Roger, Goose, we'll meet you on the other side. And friend, you have some interesting associates. Where's my wife? What's that? Coming, Waldo, Zozo! Goose, we're right behind some very strong psychic energy field. Okay, I've got to locate the exact source of that vision. The spirit of the heart never dies. Keep me posted. Yes? They seem to be in some kind of stasis. What? Everyone all right? You can do it, Zack. Zack, removing the crystal could kill her. We've got to get her back to Beta. Tools like everyone else. She does, but she stores her priceless data in those birds. Zangwo peddlers like to create an effect. The stagecoach is out of control! Sergeant, I'm sure there must be something we could do. Spy droids, this is Doom Street. That way out, let's see this bird. Manufacturer's warning, I am not an edible bird. This bird looks pretty brainless. Hey, where'd that pedulant go? Scrambled chip. I've got something. Thanks, Nico. May we come in? Ooh. Doc, there's no time! Everybody out! Uh-oh. Another stroke of the doctor's genius? Tripwire, go make sure all the alarms are deactivated. I thought the doctor could fix anything. Yes, step aside. You may applaud. Got a juicy tidbit for the overboss. Who you calling uglies? Ha! Ha! You're on his thug. Why, I'm sorry, I became a galaxy ranger. Reason number 62. Can't this thing go any faster, Goose? They're still on our tail. You don't look bluish. If there are no further objections, let's go get overboss. And the competition will know who you are. <laughs> <laughs> Captain, I'm picking up something moving our way. It looks like a Type 9X rock hopper shuttlecraft. Zachary, I'm getting a Priority 3 distress signal. Who is Wildfire? Well, it looks as if Wildfire is about to have his flame put out for good. But who would send Imperial Death Droids after him? You know Wildfire Carson, Zachary? We're as good as beached, Captain. Captain, we just lost the gyropods completely. The slightest shift could send us directly into the minefield. But life support systems are unimpaired, and our offensive weaponry is sound. A gift from the Queen of the Crown? Let's not forget what we're dealing with. Scanners show no life forms. It's just drifting. Life support systems are still... I'll give it a try. This station is thousands of years old. It was sent drifting through space when the planet it was orbiting was destroyed. There's no one left here. I thought you said this place was desert. They're nothing but hologram. Zachary, over there. Zachary, where are you? Oh! 
armor's real, but it's hollow. No, there's nothing inside of it. Huh? Too much interference. I can't tell what's inside. <gasps> They're just an X-ray projection of us. This way. Hyperflux ready for jam sync. Speck sacrificed himself to save us. Doc's right. This is an opportunity to generate a lot of goodwill among allied planets. That landscape's from Nebraska. The planet or the state? The planet, Doc. And that, hmm, that looks like a Zotrop mobile. It's not what you can see that's so special about this object. You're supposed to touch it. It's a kind of battery, a storage battery. It holds one million emotions. So are we. That's how they got in here. I've heard of her. Ever Are the bugs taking over? Call the exterminator. Earth pests that stowed away on colonist ships have found Mars much to their liking. Miller? He touched the doll. A Mars ruby. Go to the jewelry store. Don't come to me. The ruby I want isn't for sale. The owner wants to keep it. But I want it. I'm not interested in a ruby, Mr. Subtract. What really interests me is a little doll. Oh. Oh. If he leaves the building by the back exit, he'll run right into Goose. This garden, something tells me it's not as innocent as it looks. I think there's the man to see. Goose, it's Brappo, and he's got the doll. Remember, don't touch it. I'm gonna cause you some. Don't touch him. He did. Goose absorbed everything that the sensation doll had to give. One million emotions. And Goose absorbed that life force. The trash fleet is huge. We're completely outnumbered. The MindNet device will try to achieve a mind link with the Trash High Command. What? We'll never come back. The frigate Comanche up ahead. Commander Walsh has briefed us on our mission. We're to make contact with the Trash High Command. That's exactly the problem, Doc. We're such alien species to each other that the first thing we think of is extermination. That's why we have to talk to them. But Captain Kidd, you're the only one who's ever seen a trash warrior. Now that's something I'm curious about. How did you ever manage to escape? We'd become disassociated subatomic particles. I doubt they even think about it. Uh-oh, life forms up ahead. Perhaps in a lower key? There are more warriors coming from the other direction. No, higher. According to Waldo, this has a 50% chance of working. But it's the only hope we've got of finding out how they think. The fear, the terrible fear of all other life. All life is dangerous. Oh, the fear. The two-leg things, they are terrible, terrible. They will attack. Always the two leg things attack. We mean you no harm. We are a peaceful race. There are many systems in the galaxy. You don't need ours. We will destroy you if we have to. We are strong. You will only decimate your species. Let us have peace instead. Never have we known peace. It's a date. What's wrong? Something terrible has happened. This is Senator Weiner. We are dealing with a very dangerous enemy. We must find out who it is. It does work. I felt it activate my charge. Nico, make contact with the remaining MindNet component. We did it. Zachary, we can't let them stop us. Uh, hi -ya! We'll take the component with us. I think I can trace the thought image. Ready to jump, Nico. Where? Sorry, Eddie. I'm from Tuna. Kilbane is very near. I'm getting a strong impression of the mind net device. Hmm. This mind net's a fake. Nico, it's too strong. <laughs> Goose, save your charge. 
Don't use it up. Goose, save your charge. Yeah, all right. You win. You can have it if we can go free. What? Zachary, trust me. You'd better start with a low setting. Don't tell me how to handle it. Quick, gather round. I've got to shield us. The mind net machine opened their minds to one another. Leaving so soon, my dear? You're becoming tough. Thanks, Buzz Wang. Insider's privileges at the Miracle Factory. Like what, Doc? Cue ball, I'm glad you bumped into me. Launch Control has been trying to contact you. Why? Buzz Wang took off in a ranger ship, but two ships are missing. Holy cow! I'll try my psychic powers to look into the past and discover what's happened. Your brain implant is completely drained. You'd better charge up first. Set up the computer interface. Buzz Wang and little Zach are in real trouble, Cue Ball. Thanks, Zach. Iktar and his people are my friends. They're farmers, not fighters. Becca, where's your father? The sorcerers are long gone. I once had an archaeological dig with Iktar at the Fortress of Shen. That place couldn't be taken by an army. Come on, Nico. Neither do I. The whole thing is going too smoothly. No one's even tried to stop us. That's not what I mean. There's something brushing at my... and I... Oh! Huh? Why, I know this place. This is where Iktar and I excavated the ancient fortress. Basuti. That excavation was a long time ago. I couldn't have gone back in time. Or did I? I... I don't know. They're priceless relics! No! Stop that! Stop it! Ah! The fortress! Some kind of powerful illusion! Zack, your guess was correct. No act. He's focusing his psychic powers. A dragon? A Dennerite dragon! Mogul's enhancing his strength just as the implants increase ours. But how does he do it? You big lizard! You get away from him before I... Uh-oh. Nico, look out! Uh. <laughs> this so-called dragon doesn't have any psychic feel. It's not real. When I kicked the dragon on the tail, I must have physically kicked Mogul instead. <laughs> can hold a psychic shield, but not for long. Where... where is he getting his strength? Sorry, Zack, I can't. <laughs> <laughs> In the wrong hands, star stones are also very dangerous weapons. We'll have to guard Basut. Oh, I'm just worrying about poor Iktar. My brothers, the darkness encircles us. Help us. I can't pinpoint it. Something seems to be diffusing the signal. I'm taking the life raft out. Follow me at a safe distance. Right. Come on! They're getting away! Go ahead, Winter. I'll be right there. Another time. Continuing video survey. What? Goose, unidentified craft sighted. Goose, torpedo approaching! Goose, what is it? This is the source of the distress signal. It was sent years ago before the pollution blocked the transmission. The ones who came were driven crazy by the pollution. We'll take charge of them. These five Galaxy Rangers, the best we have. Lock in coordinates for our drop window and switch into auto. Let's get those jet cycles flying. The Queen has many enemies besides Earth. Goose! Don't shoot! The Freedom Fighters!
Goose, help us out. Thank you, Shane. Come on, Doc, hurry up. Go ahead. I'm not leaving without my programs. Hurry up. But it didn't blow. What are you talking about? The charges we planted didn't go off. Doc, the gun is out of control. Commander Walsh, what is it? Old Roy. We met a while back in an archaeological dig. You there? Darn tootin'. Uh, hey! It's Burrow 5000. Hiya, Nico. Roy, how are you? Fine, sure, I'm glad you're here. <laughs> it was very hard for me to resist. Roy, this is my partner, Ranger Walter Hartford. It was right here! Roy, this isn't some of your monkey shines, is it? Let's see. Within these walls, there is great danger. All who enter shall never leave. Beware the axe. Nico! Roy's not joking. Something's right here. It's here guarding a king's tomb and the treasures within. <gasps> In here! These passageways could run for miles underground. Go! No, wait, Doc! Ask! Doc! Wally! Keep this up much longer. Roy, hand me that stone. I'm not getting a thing. Try harder. <laughs> There's something peculiar about that carving. Now what? Well, it's worth a try. We do have to go up. Huh? Don't do that ever again. It wants us out. It's a laser beam barrage. I can't get anything. My charge is drained. Did anyone hear that? Humming. I hear humming sounds. <laughs> It's computers, a room full. How? The jewel! Fire at the jewel! Doc, hurry! This is it. Incredible. Roy, this discovery is priceless. Once word gets out about this, why, they'll name this museum after you. Oh, twerk nothing. <laughs> Says you. It's magnificent. A galactic chart, Roy, of precious stones. It shows planets they visited. I'm sure even Goose would have been impressed by you in action today. Howdy, Rangers! Roy, you fixed him! <laughs> <laughs> Figures Roy would get himself into trouble. Burrow! These tremors are getting worse. Keep. Let me see if it tells me something. Go to it, Nico. What is it? It's the Black Hole Gang. Treadmarks! Cover me. I'm going in. Right. Goose! N nico Roy! Oh, my head! Oh, this is Galaxy Ranger Shane Gooseman, and he is stone. For the moment. 
But Roy, what happened to you? Come in, Doc. Come in, Doc. Buzz Wang, do you read me? Hold tight, Buzz. We're on our way. Watch out for the black hole gang. Look! Not that. There they go. Nice shot. Goose, look! That's what we've been calling them. Commander, these whales are a silicon-based life form. We can't tell from the data tetragram supplied. Space Peace is always on top of issues like this. I want a complete report, and I want facts. Approaching CS-41. Oh. Can you identify that vessel? Uh, look, it's Space Peace. Scanners are picking up something approaching. Very big. Oh. Space Peace, do you read? This is Ranger 1. Zoot, maybe I should just pot on over with the whole toolbox to speed things along. A-okay here, Shane. We shouldn't be long. What are you doing out here playing pincushion? Our computers have compiled a rough breakdown of... Oh, humans are only visitors. Goose, come in. What is it? I know you're only a shuttlecraft, but I need everything you've got. What's that noise? <laughs> I wish we could tell the whale we're here. He won't be able to hear you from in here. You'll be dissolved. I know you've wanted to show us what you're made of, but this isn't the time to prove your metal. Tell him who we are and why we're here. Buzz, what happened? The whales have agreed to steer clear of all of these sectors and to confine their grazing. The miners are to raise this flag on the roids they're working so the whales will know there are people on them. <laughs> Roger, Granite Tower. Well, here we are. Planet Granite. That's good news. I haven't been to a party in Yonks. You haven't heard about the Planet Floco on this side of the frontier, then? <laughs> I guess I'm glad. Thanks a lot, Shane. And I thought I could live that one down. The plant slipped into a bacterial mutation, so we seeded some clouds and got some good rains going. They'll be feeding all the exploration groups this side of the League of Planets. Hey guys, it's party time! Ouch! So, what is the name of your girlfriend, Goose? Girlfriend? Come on, Shane, I was watching you. She is very pretty. <laughs> Negative, visibility about zero! Come on, Mel, you can catch him! Right, he's usually faster than I, but he's not running well tonight. Shh, I think I hear something. Shh, you guys, listen. Right. The docs say he'll pull through. Thank you, Zozo. Can you remember anything more? I remember Triton glowing as if he was carrying some kind of electric charge, and then I got hit. And then I don't remember anything more. I'm sorry, Goose, but I don't. Well, this someone did, and we've got to find him. Come in. Ah! Oh, oh, oh. You have a spaceship docked on this planet. Give me the command codes. Why did you shoot the boy? And that policeman? There's... What are you? Scarecrow! <laughs> oh. Pilot us in, Doc. Open all hailing frequencies and initiate scanning. Reducing power to one port. Lock in auxiliary power. Um. Easy does it. We've been stunned. I'll game you, Penrod. Suddenly, this cage doesn't seem so bad. Now what? Without my badge, I can't be sure. Zack! They won't eat these berries. Ah, oh, no creature in his right mind would ever go near this stuff. It's worse than gar- It's him. Right. But for now, we're regular Galaxy Rangers, and we have to think that way. I thought we gave him the slip. 
Those trackers are an ordinary beasts. They must be Syrian telepathic hounds. Regular ranger Zack. I'll concentrate on a trail to the waterfall and let them read that. Meanwhile, we head into the lake. Something inside it. Look! There's shelter over there! Storm's path. Cue ball would be proud. Ready when you are, Goose. We have ignition. Let's move. This arm decides. Nimrod is falling back. <gasps> There's only one character I can think of who leaves calling cards that are found wherever he commits a crime. Cards just like that. We've got you on the scopes. That's just what we figured. Beta won't like that. Scanners on wide. Kind of a psychic defense mechanism. Andorians find the very concept of captivity so repulsive, they often revert to animals when imprisoned. Okay, Joker, you're under arrest. We'll see about that. <laughs> Right here or <clears throat> Okay, Chuckles, let's see you laugh this one off. Love to stay, but I have to pop off. Not this oh, time. Oh, oh. <clears throat> oh. <laughs> Zachary. She's trying to lure you back to the Psycho Crypt. Come on, Zack. We must hurry. If they can find any evidence first. Captain, come on. Move it. Move it. Optimum. I tuned them myself. I know. Tis a far, far better thing we do than we have ever done. They still haven't been found? Terrible. And a lot, lot colder. Let's find out. <laughs> Zack, don't you recognize us? Nico. Zachary's body's in the psycho crypt. Doc, we've got to get him out. Easy, Zach. Welcome back, Cap. I'm sorry, Zach. But you know the Queen will keep her crystal as a trophy. Target on screen. Blue Wing is going in. Steady. Hold position. <laughs> Maintain position, Blue Four. Firepower is too heavy. Goose, come in. Zachary, can you track him? Can we compute a search area? We must try. Something's wrong. I can feel it. Still alive? I'm going to see if I can get a trace on him. His implant is malfunctioning. He can't control his bio defenses. Well, at least can you get a heading so we can track him? Yes, northwest. Let's go. He doesn't recognize us. Hiya, sucker. It's terrible. Our reputation will be ruined. Do you have a location for their new hideout, sir? No wonder they call this the Burning Nebula. Zachary, we're being scanned. <laughs> and instead of fighting you, we came to join your group. <laughs> So far, so good. Let's hope we get out of here without doing much damage. If Daisy gets her hands on some of the experimental weapon systems in Longshot, she could really be trouble. Goose! Must stay conscious. Must stay. Nico, can you add your psychic shield to the one around the ship? Not alone, Zack. My charge is too weak. Yes, if we can all channel our energy together. We're almost through. Too weak. Can't hold it. Can't. Uh, Nico. Finally, the Gherkins have a home. Get the young ones undercover. The rest of you, form a perimeter. Use anything that'll give you some sort of cover. Get back inside. That's an order. Hiya! Don't celebrate too soon. They'll be back. They've got us completely outnumbered. Why didn't they finish us off right then and there? 
They didn't want to destroy the Gherkins. They'll take their time and wear us down. Communications out! I sure hope Beta got our messages. I've seen better landings in my time. There must be a way to disrupt their power field. The Star Stone? Here, Captain. Are they all right? I don't know. They've lost a lot of their life force. We gherkins are a lot tougher than you might think. I'll try. You're not going to believe this. If you don't, the queen wins everything. No human technology, no kiwi food, and no Andorian hyper... We can do it by adjusting our weapon beams. Oh, Captain oh, oh, Kidd, you're uh, wonderful. Oh, 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 my petunia. Love of my life. Time to go, Nico. Um, thanks for everything. Bye. The Laredo, switch on tractor beam. Roger. Cycles locked in. Switching over. Armada ships can be destroyed by tractor beams set to 2 million cycles. Repeat. This will destroy enemy space drives and ships. Now we'll find out exactly what those two made off with. Doc, tell them. A phaser glove. It Zack, are you all right? What are they looking for? Nico, Doc, Goose, Zack, you'll head to wall cab. I want a full report. Let's go. Captain, we'll touch down on Mirabus coordinates. At least there's no evidence of crown activity. They Look, weren't looking for us. What were they looking for? A certain Captain Weege is my guess. Captain Weege, my name is Nico. This is Doc Hartford and Captain Zachary Fox. We are the Galaxy Rangers. Weege don't hide from men of flesh nor iron. <laughs> Weege, don't submerge. Aye, Weege's world is beautiful. Almost as beautiful as the young galaxy ranger. Where is this Stargate anyway? Unbelievable. Fantastic. I've never seen anything like it. An entire civilization untouched for millennia. Readings indicate incredible power surging. This is what the Queen has been looking for. We've got to find out what it is. I thought that thing was blown. We won't need it, Captain. Atomic density is unbelievable. Almost as dense as a neutron star. I'll try. Help us, please. Zack, the Stargate wasn't created to keep us from getting in. There's a key inside to open this lock. Zack, can you get the key out? Oh, out! Oh. Goose, are you all right? You got it, Zack. Another time, Weege. Looks as if their warranty just ran out. On other missions, Maya. Besides, diplomacy is my specialty. Injures Walter Hartford and Nick. Perhaps, King Spartus, you'll find we're not such bad people. That is true, Baron. They are taboo. Your Majesty, this is not what it looks like. I sensed something about that shaman. Something important. And the all-seeing eye. What was that all about? I want to talk to that shaman. We sure can't use the front door. No problem. Ready, Doc? Beckons us. Interesting. Archaeology rule number one. Be careful. I have heard of your powerful magic. Not magic, just powers of the mind. Eternity. The obelisk sings to me of the past. We seek the all-seeing eye for the king of Tarkov. What is the heart of Tarkov? Stop! Controlled by the Queen. A sensor device and a link to a big sleepy computer. You have our word, Maya. 
The Andorian Planetary Defense Shield is vital for protecting Earth, no matter how much it costs. Maybe so, but I have the feeling this... Rod <laughs> the Gamester, what's he up to? Probably no good, as usual. That suits me fine, QB. I mean, sir, A is... Maybe this is Dutch's way of saying thank. I bet it's fruit. Come on already, I love surprises. This just doesn't feel right. Let me see. <gasps> That's what I was doing. Doc, my power charge is gone. My charge seems to be working. Got it. <gasps> oh. Where were you when Premier Dutch was murdered? Aren't you a bit overdressed for bedtime? Would you like a glass of water? I know it is hard to believe, but could anyone have gotten in his study? How about you, Searchlight? Lifeline? Anyone at all? Come on, Doc. What am I, psychic? You go that way, I'll go this way. I don't think he's the killer, Doc. Someone tried to prevent Snivel from talking to us. <coughs> all right, kid. This is your wake up call. Lose one of these lately? Breakfast? From a wall about two centimeters from my head. Oh, I suppose you did. Kid, we've got our eyes on you. What are we looking for? Now you know why. So we're looking for something that isn't here, right, Doc? <laughs> oh! Well, we haven't got him yet. And it still could be anybody. Squeegee? He only repeats what someone else says. Exactly. He said no shields for you. So? So who did it? Obviously, someone wanted us to think that it was Snivel. Well, he was the only man with the keycard. We have the vital piece of evidence, safely locked away in the late Premier's study. Two Madonnas? Isn't this a slaver amulet? <clears throat> ah, Doc, watch where you're going! It was the Queen who wanted to keep Earth from getting the shields. She knew Dutch was pushing for a better defense system. Doc, look out! Try to take this guy alive. He's right over the matter-antimatter grid. That was the clue that wasn't there. You're lucky we don't bust you, kid. Why were you here, Nimrod? Your husband will be sorely missed. He was a... We heard something about it. And to think, they almost gave this mission to Goose. Something else. Life form readings in that medium. Both. Either. Someone who knows the potential of mnemonic power. That crater it made is gigantic. No, that. The mnemonic beams are affecting my implant. I sense something. Now I'm getting images, but the picture's fuzzy. She's forgotten something. She's lost some kind of power stabilizer. Hello! We must help you return to your home! Here, all right. Speaking of troll, the crown is your way home. Put it on. Not for everyone. What's this? Don't worry. She said she'd find us. Good thing we came prepared. Buzz, your electronics attract them. Mute your frequencies. Here. You've all packed a spare parts pod for you. Okay, let's move out. Looks good. Okay, but stick together. What about the speeders, Doc? Mistwalker's got me worried. Doc, we're being watched. What do you want, Willow? sense of evil here. Oh. Huh? Move away, kids! Lock that robot! Ah. You sound strange. Let me run a trace. Speak upon you. We are very near great danger. Lazarus Slade! That explains the mutations. 
What have you done? Zozo, don't you recognize us? Duck! Zozo! <laughs> Slade, you're under arrest. Dr. Slade was about to give us the antidote for his virus. Unless he wants to become ant food, try me, Motorhead. We'll feed this to the ants. They'll spray the forest with it. Thank you, Maya. We must mount up and ride. The hay are those things. Huh. <laughs> Goose, you are so witty. Good looking, too. Yes. not the work of slaver lords. It's much older and a great deal more evil. And somehow it's familiar. I feel I've encountered this power before. Haunted lands have always been a place of strange mystery. I have been in the haunted lands. We must be careful. That is no exaggeration. In the haunted lands lies the mountain that hides this planet's giant computer. I also know that you use that staff of yours to contact it. We must proceed with caution. Isn't caution? If you believe that, you're a fool. I sense something near. The scarecrow's not making for the computer. There's something else on top of that mountain. It's the old shaman. has managed to overturn the ecological statutes that protected the lichens. This is Ranger 1 to Paintsville Tower. Galaxy Rangers here on official business. Evasive. Too late. We're going down. I can't see anything in this storm. Lichens. And now the idea of having a lichen fur coat has made everyone forget about the cattle. Maybe I can help. It's an ice sailor, Doc. It can do 200 miles an hour, if the winds are right. Yes, let's fly! Nice timing! What's that rumbling sound? Ooh -hoo. Talk about cliffhead! I don't like the sound of that. What are they running from? The herds are contaminated. The ranchers have to be told not to drive those cattle to market. We'll stay here and get the proof we need from the computer system. Can you find a safe way out of here, Audra? I did it once before. The stockyards will discover that the meat is contaminated, and they'll know it was Bovo all along. <laughs> all right, Lycans, he's all yours. Do you confess to swindling the ranchers and framing these Lycans? Ransom. Nice job, my friend. Thanks. My pleasure. You know, fine. We'll check on the trees in a few hours before we head back. Here, let me show you how to do this. Okay, everybody, it's time we check the trees and mosey on back to Beta. Huh? Buzz, did you follow the directions? <laughs> oh, my. I told you conditions would be different here. Let me see that. What stage of development are they in? Hard to tell. I'd say they're entering gestation. Excuse me, sir, but perhaps it'll look like this. They seem perfectly normal. <laughs> Shh, don't cry, little Joe. The life cycle has been dramatically increased due to your twin sons. I'm sure Dr. Rojo and the vegetable lab will isolate the gene factor. Get some sleep, Sozo. The Kiwi Vegetable Lab is the best in the system. I should know that. <laughs> 
Still, I hate to see those trees cut down. Good night, Nico. Good night. Snowing? It's not cold enough to snow. On Grana, everything is happening a thousand times faster. Huh? Zozo? <laughs> Listen to me. If these trees release seed again tomorrow, we're going to lose this planet. Nico, are you there? Barely. What have you got, Cue Ball? Come in, Ranger Nico. This is Captain Fox aboard Ranger Fox. We don't know that for sure. Hang on, Nico. We've only got about two minutes. I can't get a trace. Doc, can't you locate it with your CD? We have only one minute. Don't worry. Gobblebugs are vegetarian. They don't eat kiwi. What they'll evolve into. Bovo specializes in this. Huh? Doc, the bugs transformed into flowers. GB, prime the drive. Yeah, we missed you too. Geezy seems to know a lot about the Queen's household these days. Galaxy Rangers, it will be your last chance before you arrive at the Psycho Crypt. Yes, yes, yes! Hurry, hurry, hurry! And they don't attack you. Correct, Bronto Bears eat a lot of shellfish. Here he comes. We've got to hold him in this valley. Where is the professor? Beta told us to contact him. Brace for impact! Beta, we'll head him off at the pass. He's hurt! That's a 300 ton baby! Well, after all, he was a baby once. All Bronto bears start off as Bronto cubs. We have to help him. Help him? He's been trying to eat everything in sight for the last 10 miles. We can't leave him in pain. I'll go with you, Nico. Thanks, Shane. Easy. He's in agony from the metal. Reassure him. Okay, try and pull it out. Right. Easy. Everything's gonna be all right. A little metaphone? And good as new. <laughs> Very good alien diplomacy, Doc. <laughs> Follow me. He's heading back north to the snow line. Just in time for his nap. Bye, Bronto Bear. Code 5? That's an alien invasion. We're going to hit. Some of them got the machine room. Nico. Search this floor and get everyone down to the main launch bays. Doc, check out these robots and see what makes them tick. I want you out of here. It's too dangerous. <laughs> You'll get yours, Nico. Come in, Zach. Everything looks quiet here. <laughs> My hero. I'm going to kill that Stanley! My powers are very low, but I'll do what I can. <laughs> Marok, do you know how much trouble your toys have caused? What could we possibly run into right here in the solar system? Systems check! Wait a minute! Uh, 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 system spark? seems to have quieted down. Zachary, come in. Do you copy? Take the comm. I'll check it out. It's heading for the sick bay. I hear you. Goose. Okay, report. It soaks up power like a sponge. We could use more powerful weapons, but I'm afraid we'll only end up blowing the ship apart. If it tries to tap into the engines, it'll blow the ship apart anyway. We have to hunt it down. We can't risk this getting loose Earthside. This isn't some freak occurrence. Jane, be careful. Doc, stabilize the flux grid! Don't remind me! Come in, Beta. Get a medevac shuttle to match orbits and take Zachary off. The most advanced genetic engineering went into those cattle. Wyndham, I think we can handle a herd of cows. Uh, you mean a roundup? 
We'll call ahead to Fort Wyndham for a party to meet us. Thanks for the compliment, Mr. Toon. This sure is fine country. Your man there's doing a fine job. Waldo, be careful. Here you go, Waldo. Finally, nutrients. I'll get that. I'm all right. Just for a second, I had the sense of... It's gone now. I've lost it. That's what I sensed last night. This man has betrayed us. We'll never turn them before they reach the Badlands. We're free! Yeehaw! joke about it, but what Doc did took a lot of courage. That top secret engine will render the first generation hyperdrives obsolete. It's responding. Relative airspeed is well within safety parameters. I'm monitoring very unusual readings from that unidentified object. There's a town close by. The local sheriff will probably have maps of the area. There was something, Zack. I felt it too. It's still a dangerous ride. Drop your blaster and step aside. We'll handle your new playmate. Scale the tower. Over this distance, I need a supercharge to do that. We have to put our powers together. And Scarecrow? Our most vital information is gone from the master computer. Parts of the series five implants. They better come up with the answer soon. I can cause a mind diversion. We can each spare a little power. Come on, man, inside. Hold up, guys. To think I gave up a lucrative computer psychiatry practice for this. Sit tight, everyone. Quiet, I hear something. Just what are you doing? Don't do it, Doc. Why not? Uh, would you believe I lost my power? Quit stalling. It'll be tough, cue ball. Magic. Come on, guys. Science. Ice cream's on me. Magic. Zach and Zozo ride with him. We'll follow on Voyager and Mel. I wonder why this planet was deserted for so long. Nico, my sense. Apollo 5000! I don't believe it! This is Galaxy Ranger Zachary Fox and Zozo. I'm sure of it. Since we got here, I felt strong psychic energy. absorb the energies of the surface population and as they fill up produce kinetic energy from what I can tell this has happened several times and the quakes are so bad they destroy the civilizations yes and with all the mining going on the bedrock of crystals is being exposed to the corrosive effects of the atmosphere we've only got about two hours captain that's all before this rock is history I'm sorry Roy here you finally made your fortune in mining. That means they could be anywhere. Their tracking gear must have been destroyed in the explosion. We have enough fuel for three hours. Doc, get a fix on that. If the outlaws get those ships, they'd scatter all over the galaxy. No word from Goose. Come on, Goose. I'm picking up something. It's Goose. Captain Goose is trying to tell me something. Request Hacksaw. Urgent. On Mesa? How do you know that? You can find the Gunrunners at the last outpost trading center. Chief Pawnee's people? That's impossible. Doc and I know them too well. They befriended us. They already have death steeds taken from the Queen's Crown agents. It adds up. Not in my book. We've got straight. Look around. Why have you been selling weapons to Chief Pawnee's people? We're not so sure that Chief Pawnee is responsible for these disappearances. We've got to talk to them before they launch another attack. 
Chief Pawnee has to be told that the settlers mean his people no harm. Dismount, Captain. Drop your blaster and follow me. We have come in peace, Chief Pawnee. Then why have you broken the treaty and sent your braves to attack the wagon train? It is your people who have broken the treaty. Settlers have also been disappearing. We don't know, but with your help, perhaps we can find out. These tunnels, the desert must be undermined with them. Sounds like digging. Dead end. Wait, I hear something. About that. I don't suppose you got its phone number. So, by dropping gas canisters into all the openings except this one, you think we can get this creature to surface right here? We have to try to communicate with it. Zack, this creature has lived here for hundreds of years. This desert is its home, and the caverns and tunnels are its handiwork. Ah! What are you stooges building? That's a crazy rule. Look who's here! And Miss Nico! What is a pretty little gal like you doing in a place like this? Resisting the urge to make buzzard bait out of you? You're so cute when you're mad, Miss Nico. plan to ambush them. They're going to steal their tracking devices and claim that land. Uh, Cody! What happened? Uh, Easy. Uh, You're lucky to be alive. Did you get a look at them? Nope. Looks like I lost them. Come on, Cody. We're going after that claim. Wait! Stop! Oops! My mistake. <laughs> All of them! Got grace, grit, and gumption. And if you ever tire of riding with these owl hoots, I'd be proud to have you partner with me. Thanks for the offer, but I think I'll stay on this side of the law. You guys started without us. You're under arrest, fat man. Because oh. you'd just hate to see Mr. Subtract get away, wouldn't you? Then she's not around here. Why's that? There are people who need that medicine. Somebody there? No, you all go under. I'll get them out. Is the Tri-D working yet, Goose? Or a new group on the music scene, the Galaxy Rangers. A rock band? You're kidding. I love it. Let's rock and roll, dudes. War bow. Come on, Zach. No, that's no. Use the mind net device on us. If he uses that on the audience, why bother? So they pulled us out of the mind net spell. Yeah, but do we want them winning a recording contract? Cubal, where are you? Who is that? Cubal, she's adorable. I'm sorry you had to come such a long way for nothing, but that. What's going on around here? Hey, check out these readings from the last collision. Nothing. Not even Sam is big enough to handle these energy levels. Could Ograbgo be endangering this station? The last collision was about ten times past the safety level of this machine. Doc, can you talk to this tin can? <laughs> Shane! Shane! Oh no, Shane. He's gone. Come on, we've got to get out of here. Two suits. Somebody has to stay here. Oh, grab go! You're under arrest! Doc, come in! Shane! Yes, Shane! Where are you? Sam and the alien must have saved you, Goose. Come on, Doc, get him out. Shane! <laughs>
<laughs> You're alive! Rangers Hartford and Nico up. Me too. Did you put Voyager to bed? Not without a fuss. She wanted to ride up front with us. You should know. You programmed. Hyper shunt set. Ready when you are. Jump coordinates load. I'm trying. Doc, look! Cutting flux coils. Ah! <laughs> One nutty horse. Doc! That's lovely. Thank you. I under here. This storm came out of nowhere. Oh, you noticed. I yes, we have traveled a great distance from the other side of the sky. Huh? These beings have natural psychic abilities. They really did call to us. A slave alarm. Got it. It is promised that Poppy will put an end to the chaos and return the world to hell. Thank you, Chief. But Hopi wishes you to feed your children first. I got a trace on that one. I hear you. She's probably right, Doc. Let's not waste time arguing. You and don't call me Wilbur. Both huh? readings confirm. This way. This machine has been disrupting the weather. We've got to contact Beta. Come on. This way. We could say the same of you. Proud of yourself, huh? Yeah. Getting a little bored? We've got to turn that machine off. This way. <laughs> My turn. Buy me some time. Time running out, Doc. Hope you have enough charge left in you to get us out of here. Here we She's needed on other worlds. Look below. The lava flow has cooled. Nico, I'm sorry to interrupt you, but we have a briefing scheduled for 0900 hours. I haven't forgotten, Zachary. I'll be there. But mind and body must be in harmony with spirit for duty to be served. Not bad. Learn a little something every day. That's what Ariel always said. Oh, no. Oh, Nico. I was just checking out this new control unit for my son. Zachary, I need a ranger interceptor. I've been summoned. Summoned by whom? By my mentor, my my teacher. There's danger, Zachary, tremendous danger, and I have to help fight it. Well, if there's danger, we're in it together. Commander Walsh will issue a ship. Spaceship. <gasps> if the Megamind destroys all life, and just as you <gasps> said, my child. Ariel. Ariel, what about the Megamind? If I'd been there when it got free, I'd be a prisoner too. Nico and I must get to Xanadu and attack the Megamind before it can drain the Circle members completely. Oh, you think your stupid Nico can help you? <laughs> Zachary, no! We must hurry to Xanadu. Nico, will you forget those foolish toys? Sometimes they come in handy, Ariel. I'll be ready as soon as I recharge my Series 5 implant. Hyperspace travel is not quite as dramatic, however it does get us there. Xanadu is just ahead. Then why did you and the other Circle members encourage me to join Baby? Oh, no! Yes, Ariel? Huh, let's see. One in each corner. Plus one looking at each. Sixteen. Right, Ariel? Ariel, what about the ones on their tail? They will attack us no matter what. And yet never in 100,000 years. 
Round one goes to you, Ariel. Fear and anger caused him to lose his grip on the illusion. Have you any idea what I do to rude rabbits, bunny bra- Don't blame this one on me. We all have our childhood memories. Just remember, if we weaken the Mega Mind's control of the illusions, we weaken his power. What does that mean? <laughs> curiouser and curiouser. Why not? From what we've seen, you won't do a very good job of it. If we play it his way, we reinforce his control. But if we throw him off guard, we can rattle him. I'm open to suggestions. You're not playing fair! I seldom do, Creighton. And you won't be invited back? <laughs> to oneself, Zachary. That's our strongest flaw. And I might even answer some of them. He's not responding to radio query, but I'm reading a faint life signal. I think he's in trouble, Captain. Goose, are you all right? Better than ever. I'm going to have to get some new shoes, though. Aye, aye, Captain. We're on our way. It's stuffy in here. Greetings, Wildfire. Carson's aboard, sir, but unconscious. Until we ascertain the cause, Captain, we should be considered under standard quarantine. I haven't forgot. RB, are you here? Sorry about the blue fire field. Will you pump symptom data and medical history through our computer so I can do onboard analysis? Right. How long has he been out, RB? Cody has been subject to intermittent periods of vivid hallucination, lucidity, and unconsciousness. Since before leaving school, was it love? <laughs> Doc, Cody's waking up. Doc Holliday? Who's that? Doc Holliday was a famous old American Western figure. She can step on your foot, pour your drink, and spit your eye without breaking stride. Sounds like fun, Cody. He, according to this date. And don't call me Louisey. Not till we get there, but I can't figure is where. I guess we'll find out soon enough. Captain, have you got our position? Well, we might as well enjoy the ride. I... That'll be enough of that, Doc. Tell me, Cody, how did you ever get to be such a wild, unruly hombre? Well, Louise, the truth of the matter is... I got the feeling that in spite of all your law-breaking and troublemaking, you're a pretty good old guy, Cody. Well, Louise, the trouble is my middle name. Why does she do that? Doc, if anyone finds out where Rangers were dead, plus Cody's out of his mind, he's sick. We shouldn't have let him out of here. I don't really think we can stop him, Louise. If you think for one minute you're going to get me in this, this dance hall outfit, you're crazier than Cody. Better these costumes, Nico, than our Ranger uniforms. Stop. One more Louise out of you, and I'll put you where it hurts. Be cool, Louise. Uh... I'll have a ginger ale. What? <laughs> In a dirty glass. The same for me. Wildfire! Leave him alone! You think you're pretty tough. 
how a good-looking human like you ever got to be a friend of an old pile of sawdust and bones like Cody is beyond me. Boys! Cody, you okay? Wow. Going somewhere? Stop at the parking lot. Goose, I hate to tell you this, but I think you forgot to use your wrench on one of their ships. Come on, Doc, I'm starved. Feels as if a scrambled signal controls the door mechanism. Risk it. Hold it, bird bait. In a star is born. <laughs> you can say that. Have you any idea who's behind it? Right up the doctor's alley. I'll call the sheriff. Will do. Let me see if I can manage a link. I'll try it. About water, a danger to all of us. That's got to be it. A little more! What's happening, Zachary? Maintain <laughs> command, mister. Put the ship on red alert. Not anymore. A message coming in on an unauthorized carrier. We we'll let that Cyclops loose. He broke out of Deltoid Rock. The general said two, champion. That's why the best are going in. Got any readings? Nothing. Goose! Are you okay? Step into my web, said the spider to the goose. Voice projection. The general is here, all right. I'm going to squash that cyclops. If I don't get him first. Go, girl. I'll handle this. Sure, the general saving the best for last. Think these are here for a purpose? Wait till we get through with them. Stay close, Nico. They're multiplying. I'll break an escape route for you. No need, Shane. Finally, spectator sport. Feeling from this canyon. Stop in here. By 
Angel signs weak. She's dead. Oh, Buzz Wang, I'd give you a big kiss if I didn't think it would make your lips rust. Actually, it would be imprecise to say that I have it. To drive them back. Do it, Zack. Cover me. Zack, what a shot! Brilliant! How's the kid? He's resting. Easy on him, Captain. It's just as much a mystery to him. I'm sorry, everyone. Are you all right? Yeah. Goose Man, you're... Surprise? No! Yes! Oh, did anyone see you enter this Peggy shop? As valuable as the Sundancer Project? Did Geezy not send you the right information? Yes! I set up a small business deal between Grandpa and this male humming about six months ago. I am a respectable businessman. Billy, where is he? You still have a chance to give yourself up. Billy, you'll make new friends. Billy? Nico, check out the horse. He'll be just fine. You know, Keezy, you could become a deputy ranger for that. We won't stand a chance against the Crown Armada. We can't risk any more interceptor squadrons.